Hey, I'm Sean. And I'm Jackie. And this is is Rookie Rookie Roost. Roost. So this week was all about siding. We were able to get the cedar bevel siding all cut, stained, and up. So now all we have left for siding are the shakes on either end of the house. So the siding was not without errors. There were a few times where we had to cut after we'd already stained and then restain, and a couple other spots where we sort of had to just fudge a piece in to make it look good. Yeah, there was actually, um, when we went to go do the front, we realized that we were missing pieces. So, yeah, yeah. that was another thing that we had to do. Yeah, we were fighting a bit of the weather this week. Um, the day that we got it all finally cut, we basically cut the entire front and back, minus maybe a third of it, all in one day. So from dawn till dusk just cutting, brought it all home to our other home, to, uh, okay, that's stupid, to the garage to stain, and that's where we realized we had made some errors. We started off by using a numbering system, but that quickly fell by the wayside when we were rushing. So lessons learned, you know, um, next time, if we ever build a tiny house, numbering system. And yeah. as usual, don't rush. That's just good advice in general. And test fit. Mm. Yeah, lots of that. Yeah. So in our last update, we mentioned that we were going to be changing the color just because we thought it was too dark and too orange. So this is what we came up with. Um, it's more of just a clear coat, so you can see more of the natural cedar, and we think it looks a lot better with the green. One annoying thing we had to deal with was finally actually deciding where our vents were gonna go in our back wall. So one morning was spent frantically figuring out exactly where all that's gonna position. So neither one of us have really stained before, so it took us a little bit to get a system going, but we figured it out and it went pretty smooth. So I wish there was more to say this week, but really it was all siding. It's been a very grueling, long, time-consuming process. And we're happy to have at least the bevel siding out of the way. Hopefully shakes don't give us as much trouble. So the total amount of hours spent on the build so far is 354. And the total amount we've spent on the house is $23,594. So next week we're going to be working on the shakes. Uh, hopefully it goes pretty smooth. we got a lot of staining to do. Lots of little pieces. Hundreds, hundreds, so yeah, hopefully it doesn't take too long. We also hope to paint our door this week, maybe even tomorrow. Mm. So that's it for this week. See you next time. At the Roost. Bye. Later. Be sure to like and comment if you enjoyed this video. And you can click on the preview tiles to check out some of our other videos. Don't forget to subscribe if you're new to the channel. You can also follow us on social media. 